Good morning and welcome to my office. This is Sharon Ann Irwin and I'm creating a quick little video here. Um, it's just a tutorial uh, to help some of my teammates that are having a common question. And the common question is when they're creating content or laying out a strategy for their blogging efforts, uh, what are some of the things that they should be writing about and how do they know if what they're writing about actually has a chance of showing up in the Google results, which is what we all want to do with our content, is we want to show up on the first page of Google so that we get more eyeballs looking at what it is that we have to offer in terms of the value that we're putting in the marketplace. So to keep it really simple this morning, I'm just going to go through a quick exercise here on my computer um, to show you some of the free tools that you can use that are available to everyone just simply through Google um, to start doing some research so that you know whether you're on the right track or not. So this is an example that I've created for somebody that is specifically looking at a couple of different niches, one of which is online video marketing. So I simply just type that in and do you notice how right underneath as I typed that in Google is showing me three other common searches when somebody types in online video marketing. Um, that's really important. So what you want to do is you want to take online video marketing and the other results that show up in the drop down and put those into a spreadsheet. So you'll have a research spreadsheet for each one of the keyword areas that you're hoping to rank for on the first page of Google. Um, and I'll explain a little bit more about the spreadsheet. Um, and what you're going to put into the spreadsheet. But put your keywords in first. And then also take a scroll down, look at, <clears throat> you know, how many people are paying to show up here. Quite a few. So it's probably a very competitive keyword, but we'll take a look at that in a minute. <clears throat> and if you scroll all the way down to the bottom of the page, here's some additional related searches that you can also put into your spreadsheet. Okay, so that's quite a few just on one keyword. And now we're going to go over to Google's free keyword tool. Of course, there's other tools that are available in the marketplace that have a lot of power. But for this video and the purposes of getting people, you know, onto the fast track, and not feeling like they're stuck on what their strategy should be for content, um, this is a real easy way to scoop up ideas and quickly analyze if you are going to have the ability to compete for the first page of Google. So I just type in my phrase there after I get to the free keyword tool and I hit search. <clears throat> So, yes, high competition, which is what I thought would be the case since there were so many advertisers on that page. It gets 6,600 monthly searches. Um, and you'll notice this gives you two pages of information. So on the first page, it's results 1 through 50. And on the second page, it's 50 through 100. Now, you can sort um, by level of competition. And what that means is I just kind of scroll through and look for anything that might be low. Because if it's low competition, then obviously that's a great area to get to the first page of Google. So you click on. All right. So if I click the competition button, it sorts it. OK, this is interesting. Video branding, branding video. Those are hot, 12,000 searches a month, low competition. So that's what you're looking for. You're looking for low competition, and you're looking for the keywords that match up with, you know, the type of training or the type of product or service that you're wanting to promote. And then you make those part of your keyword strategy. Okay, so I know this sounds, you know, simple, but... Let's, this is another thing you can do, like video branding. You can click here 
you can go look out on Google who is it that's in the video branding space look at the different people that are putting information out here and if you see anything that looks really good let's see what we see here nothing is really catching my eye in terms of a site that specifically just focuses on that niche um, except for this TV branding uh, but we're not doing TV branding so that wouldn't really relate to internet marketing or home-based business video branding so it looks like there could be space here for someone to compete with you know how do you get your home-based business video branding done um, but what I was going to say is if you if for some reason you did find a site that was you know closely related to what you were thinking of creating you could always come back here and take the keyword phrase out of here and pop that person's website in here and if you put that person's website in here and click search it'll show you magically the keywords that they actually use in their website and the ones that they're competing with so it's kind of like a little bit of a cheat sheet so hopefully this video has been helpful for you um, as a recap the first thing you do is just go to Google type in your keywords look at the drop-down options plug those into your spreadsheet then look at the bottom for the related searches plug those into your spreadsheet and you can actually bring all of those keywords over here and type them in one by one and make a note in your spreadsheet what the level of competition is what the global monthly searches are and then you can sort it in your own spreadsheet so that you know when you're doing your marketing for each keyword when you write up you know things whether it's a review or a promotion of a product or just a simple training tutorial on that particular keyword um, you'll know that hey I'm starting out with all the ones that are low competition and I'm going to create content around that keyword and you can build your site around you know three or five or however many keywords that you want to focus on you're at least you know that you're building it now with a strategy that's going to give you a chance to show up on the first page of Google um, and that's it for today bye for now